Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today in this video we are going to see how to make this beautiful table center piece. So the measurement for this is, here you can see, so let's turn this, so here at this widest point it measures about 17 inches or 43 centimeter. And for making this doily I have used polyester yarn which we normally use for making bags so this is a very sturdy so I have used this yarn and crochet hook I have used 3.5 millimeter crochet hook for this project so this is a very beautiful project so let's get started so first we are going to make a magic circle then we will chain 3 1 2 3 so this chain 3 counts as a double crochet then we are going to chain 1 and work double crochet into the magic circle so this counts as one double crochet chain 1 and one double crochet so we are going to repeat this chain 1 double crochet in the circle chain 1 double crochet in chain 1 double crochet again chain 1 double crochet in the magic circle so like this we are going to make a total of 10 double crochets with chain 1 space so chain 1 double crochet chain 1 double crochet chain 1 double crochet so here we have total of 10 double crochets now I'm going to pull this yarn tail and close the center space now I'm going to close this circle so for that chain 1 make a slip stitch on top of the first chain 3 so this is our chain 3 so on top of the third chain here we are going to slip stitch and finish this first round so here's our first round so for the next round we are going to chain three which counts as a double crochet then work another double crochet into the same stitch so into the same stitch work another double crochet so we have two double crochets increase in the stitch then chain two and work two double crochets on top of the next stitch one and two then chain two increase in the next stitch that is two double crochets one and two in the same stitch then chain 2 2 double crochets into the next stitch 1 and 2 so like this we are going to repeat and finish this round so here I am at the end of this round I am going to make a slip stitch on top of this first chain 3 and finish this round so this is how we we will finish each round so our second round is done then we will start with next round for that chain 3 and we are going to work two double crochets into the next stitch which is the increase so into the next stitch make two double crochets so one and two then I'm going to so we have three double crochets here so chain two and we will do the same work one double crochet on top of the first stitch and work two double crochets into the next stitch which is the increase one and two then chain two work one double crochet into the first stitch so one then increase in the next stitch one 
and two in the same stitch then chain two one double crochet in the first stitch and two double crochets into the next stitch one and two so like this we are going to repeat the same pattern and finish this round so here this round is complete so for the next round I'm going to chain three one two three work one double crochet into the next stitch one and then increase in the next stitch that is two double crochets one and two into the same stitch then chain two then work one double crochet in the first two stitches one and two two then into the third stitch we will work increase that is two double crochets one and two into the same stitch then chain two one double crochet in the first two stitches one two and increase in the third stitch one and two so like this we are going to repeat around and finish this round so here i have finished this round so for the next round we are going to chain three work one double crochet into the next two stitches so one two then increase in the next stitch it's two double crochets into the same stitch one and two in the same stitch then chain three one two three and work one double crochet into the first three stitches so one two three then work increase in the fourth stitch then chain three one two three work one double crochet in the first three stitches one two three and increase in the fourth stitch one and two into the same stitch so like this we are going to repeat and finish this round in here so i have finished this round so for the next round we are going to chain three work one double crochet into the next three stitches one two three then we will increase in the next stitch one and two in the same stitch then chain three work one double crochet in the first four stitches one two three and four then increase in the then in the fifth stitch we will increase so one and two in the same stitch then chain three we are going to repeat the same one double crochet into the first four stitches one two three four then increase in the next stitch one and two into the same stitch so like this we are going to 
continue and finish this round in here so here I have finished this round so let's do the next round so for the next round we are going to chain 3 work 1 double crochet into the next 2 stitches so 1 then 2 so we have 3 double crochets here including the first chain 3 then chain 2 and work 1 double crochet into the next 3 stitches 1 2 3 so here you can see we have formed one chain 2 space here so then we will chain 3 repeat the same we will work one double crochet in the first three stitches one two three chain two one two and work one double crochet in the next three stitches one two three then chain three one double crochet in the first three stitches one two three then chain two work one double crochet in the next three stitches one two and three so like this we are going to repeat this same pattern around and finish this round so here i have finished this round for the next round I'm going to chain three work one double crochet in the next two stitches one then two then i'm going to chain two work one double crochet into this chain two space so one double crochet and again we will chain two and work one double crochet in these three stitches one two and three so here we can see we have made two chain two spaces then we will chain two we will repeat the same work three double crochets one two three chain two one two then double crochet into this chain 2 space and again chain 2 and work these 3 double crochets 1 2 and 3 then chain 2 work 1 double crochet in the 3 stitches 1 2 3 then chain 2 double crochet into the chain 2 space then chain 2 work these 3 double crochets 1 2 and 3 so like this we are going to continue this same pattern around and finish this round here. So here I have completed this round. Then we will do the next round for that chain 3. Work 1 double crochet into the next 2 stitches. So 1, 2, then we will chain 2, work 1 double crochet into this first chain 2 space, then again chain 2, 
work one double crochet into this next chain two space then chain two and we will work these three double crochets one two and three so here we have three spaces in this round then we will chain two repeat the same work the first three double crochets one two three then chain two double crochet in the first chain two space then again chain two double crochet into the next chain two space and again chain two and we will work these three double crochets one two and three then we will chain two work these three double crochets one two three chain two double crochet in this first space again chain two double crochet into the next space then again chain two work these three double crochets one two three so like this we are going to repeat this same pattern around and finish it here so here you can see i have finished this round we will continue with the next one for that chain three double crochet in the next two stitches so one two then we will chain two double crochet in the first space again chain two double crochet in the next space again chain two double crochet into the third space then again chain two and we will work these three double crochets one two and three so here we have four spaces one two three and four so like this we will repeat chain two work these three double crochets one two and three chain two double crochet in the first chain two space chain two double crochet in the next space chain two double crochet into the next space then again chain two one two then we will work these three double crochets one two and three so like this we are going to repeat this same pattern around and finish it in here so here you can see we have finished the rounds so for the next round chain 3 work 1 double crochet into the next 2 stitches 1 and 2 then we are going to work one double crochet into this chain two space then we will chain two 
double crochet into the next space again chain 2 double crochet into the next space again chain 2 we will double crochet into this then double crochet into the next space then we will work these three double crochets one two and three so here you can see we have decreased the space so we have three spaces here we are going to repeat the same so chain two work these three double crochets one two and three then double crochet into this first space then chain two double crochet into the next space chain two double crochet into the next space again chain two and double crochet into the next space then we will work these three double crochets one two and three so like this we are going to repeat round and finish this round in here so here you can see i have finished this round so let's continue with the next round so for that i'm going to slip stitch into the next stitch and start the next round from here so chain three which counts as a double crochet then work two double crochets one and two then work one double crochet into the first space then we will chain two work one double crochet into the next space again chain two work one double crochet into the next space then we will work the first three double crochets so one two and three then we will skip this last stitch we will chain two and into this chain two space we are going to work one double crochet so one double crochet and again chain two we are going to repeat the same in here skip the first stitch work the next three double crochets one two and three then work one double crochet into the first space then we will chain two double crochet into the next space again chain two double crochet into the next space then we will work the first three double crochets one two and three then we will chain two work one double crochet into this chain two space so one double crochet then again chain two then we will repeat the same process leave the first stitch and work the next three double crochets one two three then double crochet into this first space chain two double crochet into the next space then again chain two double crochet into the 
next space then work one double crochet in the first three stitches one two and three so like this we are going to repeat this same pattern around and finish this round in here here we will finish this round so here you can see I have finished this round so for the next round I'm going to make a slip stitch into the next stitch and then we will chain 3 work 1 double crochet into the next 2 stitches 1 2 2 and 1 double crochet in the first space then chain 2 1 double crochet into the next space then we will work 1 double crochet in the first 3 stitches 1 2 3 so here we have only one space so next we are going to chain 2 and we are going to skip this stitch and this space and work 1 double crochet into this stitch right here then we will chain 3 1 2 3 and work 1 double crochet into the same stitch then chain 2 again we will repeat the same skip the first stitch work 1 double crochet into the next 3 stitches 1 2 3 then double crochet into this space here then chain 2 work 1 double crochet into this next space then 1 double crochet in the first 3 stitches 1 2 and 3 then we will chain 2 so skip this last stitch and space and work 1 double crochet on top of this double crochet and then we will chain 3 and work 1 double crochet into the same stitch and then we will repeat the same pattern like this so continue around and finish this round so here you can see I have finished this round so for the next round I am going to make a slip stitch into the next stitch then chain 3 2 3 work 1 double crochet into the next 2 stitches so 1 and 2 then into this chain 2 space we are going to work 2 double crochets here so 1 and 2 then work 1 double crochet into the next 3 stitches 1 2 and 3 so then we are going to skip the last stitch chain 2 work so skip the stitch and space and work double crochet on top of this double crochet here then work 2 double crochets into this chain 3 space 1 and 2 then we are going to chain 7 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and we will work 2 more double crochets into the same space here one 
1 and 2 then work one double crochet on top of this next double crochet so here like this we will repeat so here we have three double crochet chain seven and three double crochets then we will chain two and repeat the same pattern so we are going to skip the first stitch and work the next three double crochets one two three then double crochet into this space two double crochets then again work one double crochet on top of the next three stitches one two and three then chain two work one double crochet on top of this double crochet here and work two double crochets into this chain three space one two then we are going to chain seven again one two three four five six seven and work two double crochets into the same space one two then one double crochet on top of this double crochet then we will chain two and repeat the same skip the first stitch work three double crochets so like this we are going to repeat this same pattern in this round so work around and finish this round in here so here i have finished this round for the next round i'm going to make a slip stitch into the next stitch here then I am going to chain 3, 1, 2, 3 which counts as a double crochet. Then work 1 double crochet into the next 5 stitches. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So here we have 6 double crochets including the first chain three then i'm going to chain four one two three four and we will skip this stitch and the next space work a single crochet on top of this first double crochet here so single crochet here and then into this chain seven space we are going to work 15 double crochets so here we will work 15 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 10 then move these stitches here and make some space we'll continue 11 12 13 14 and 15 so here we have made 15 double crochets in this chain 7 space then I'm going to skip the next two stitches and single crochet into the third stitch so here we have made this then we will chain 4 2 3 4 we will skip the first and last stitch and work the center six double crochets so skip the first stitch then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
two, three, four, five, and six. Then we will skip the last stitch, then chain four, three, four, single crochet on top of this, first double crochet here and work 15 double crochets into this, next chain seven space here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and 15 then I'm going to skip the next two stitches and single crochet into the third stitch then we will chain 4 we will work the center 6 double crochets so 1 so like this we will repeat around and finish this round in here So here I have finished this round for the next round I am going to slip stitch into the next stitch then we will chain 3 work 1 double crochet into the next 3 stitches 1 2 and 3 then we will chain 2 skip the last stitch then single crochet into this space here so make a single crochet then we are going to make a double crochet on top of this first double crochet not on top of this so here not in this single crochet work on top of this double crochet so one double crochet then we will chain 2 then skip one stitch and double crochet into the next stitch then again chain two skip one stitch and double crochet into the next stitch chain two skip one and double crochet into the next stitch chain two skip one and double crochet into the next stitch chain 2 skip 1 double crochet in the next stitch chain 2 skip 1 double crochet in the next stitch again chain 2 skip 1 and double crochet into the next stitch so here we have 1 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 spaces. So we have 7 spaces here. Then we are going to work a single crochet into this space. So we have made 7 spaces. Then we are going to chain 2. We will skip the first and last stitch and work the center 4 double crochets. So one, two, three, and four. Then we will chain two, work a single crochet into this space. Then we will repeat the same. 
double crochet on top of the first double crochet chain 2 skip 1 double crochet in the next stitch chain 2 skip 1 double crochet in the next stitch in chain 2 then skip 1 double crochet into the next stitch chain 2 skip 1 double crochet in the next stitch chain 2 skip 1 double crochet in the next stitch chain 2 skip 1 double crochet in the next stitch then chain 2 skip 1 and double crochet in the next stitch here and then I'm going to make a single crochet into this space then chain 2 so here we will skip the first stitch and work one double crochet into the next four stitches 2 3 and 4 so like this we are going to repeat this pattern in this round and finish this in here so here you can see I have finished this round so for the next round I am going to make a slip stitch into the next stitch then chain 3 and work 1 double crochet into the next stitch so we have 2 double crochets here then chain 1 and we are going to skip this part and into this first chain 2 space here we are going to work 3 double crochets so here 3 double crochets 1 2 and 3 then 3 double crochets into the next space 1 2 3 then 3 in the next space 1 2 3 so like this we will work 3 double crochets into each chain 2 space 1 2 3 and 1 2 and 3 again 1 2 and 3 and then again 1 2 and 3 so here I have made 3 double crochets into the 7 chain 2 spaces then chain 1 skip the first and last stitch and work the center 2 double crochets so here 1 and 2 then we are going to repeat the same pattern chain 1 so here work 3 double crochets in this first chain 2 space 1 2 3 and again next space 1 2 3 then again 3 double crochets in next space 1 2 3 And again 1, 2, 3, then 1, 2, 3, then again 3 double crochets, 1, 2, 3 then again 3 double crochets 1 
2 and 3. So here I have finished the second set. Then chain 1 and work the center 2 double crochets. So 1 and 2. So we are going to repeat this same pattern in this round. So work around and finish it in here. So here you can see I have finished this round. So next we are going to work our last round for this project. So for that we are going to chain 1 and work 1 single crochet into the next stitch. And then we are going to chain for 1, 2, 3, 4 and we are going to skip the first 3 stitches and insert our hook between these. So here I am going to insert my hook and work a single crochet. Then chain 4 again 1, 2, 3, 4. Then skip the next 3 stitches and into this gap we will make one single crochet. Then again chain 4. Skip the next 3 stitches and into this gap we will work one single crochet. Then chain 4. Skip 3 and single crochet into the gap. Then chain 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, skip 3 and single crochet into the gap. Then again chain 4, 3, 4, skip 3 and single crochet into the gap. Then again chain 4, 2, 3, 4, we are going to skip this 3 stitches and we are going to work one single crochet on top of these two double crochets. One and two. Then we will chain four again and repeat the same process. Skip the first three stitches. Single crochet in the gap. Chain four. Skip three stitches and single crochet in the gap. And again chain four. Skip 3 stitches and single crochet in the gap. Chain 4. Skip 3 stitches and single crochet in the gap. Then again. Chain 4. 4. Skip 3 stitches and single crochet in the gap. Then chain 4. Skip 3 stitches and single crochet in the gap. Then again chain 4. Skip 3 stitches and single crochet on top of these 2 double crochets. 1 and 2. Then we will chain 4 and repeat the same process. So work around and I will meet you here at this end. So here I am at the end of this last round. I have made chain 4. Now I am going to make a slip stitch on top of this first chain 1 that we made. So here in this insert your hook in this chain 1. So insert your hook in here and make a slip stitch. Then I am going to chain 1 and cut off the yarn and pull the yarn through. So that's the last round. Now I'm going to hide all the yarn tails. So a beautiful table center piece project is now ready. I hope you guys like this video tutorial. So hit the like button, share with your friends and subscribe to my channel for more videos. Thank you guys. Bye bye.